Hey guys, it is I, Mark and Corey, and I have a victory to share with y'all. So I was um, making breakfast and stuff, and out of nowhere, my sink clogged, right? It was, it was full, it was like, here's, here's the sink. It was like up to here, right, and water, and nothing, like I ran the garbage disposal for like 10 minutes, nothing, nothing worked, nothing changed. But then, I was smart, right? I'm like, okay, clearly there's a pipe blocked. And I know where the blockage occurred because, um, here, actually, I'll just show you. I'll just show you instead of trying to explain it. So here, right, let's get let's get deep in here. So we got this thing, which apparently is like a outflow pipe in case it gets overfilled because this pipe actually comes out of that little gray thing there, like shoots out of there. Found that out the hard way, it got splashed. Anyway, so the blockage was in this pipe. I can guarantee it was in this pipe because there was nothing in here. And it's because this one is in there and I could drain out of there no problem I heard it drain so the blockage was somewhere in here so I was like okay what do you use to unclog a pipe fuck a plunger that's what you fucking use so I broke out my plunger and I just stood here running the garbage disposal I'm just plunging like a son of a bitch and then it just had this massive like and then it just ran like a son of a bitch and I'm like yes I unclogged whatever was clogging it so now it's completely fine but i was just like oh man is this the first time in like more than a year i'm actually gonna have to talk to my goddamn landlords about shit oh man but luckily i don't have to so hooray rocking the amel stardust shirt yeah anyway um it's about an hour before i have to catch the bus i've got a meeting with my communication advisor today um basically like i don't understand the um, the rules of that particular relationship. I don't know what I need to inform them of throughout this final year. So that's the point of this meeting is I want to go and be like, okay, what do we need to communicate in order for me to get out of here? Like, what do I need to tell you? What do you need to help me with? What do I need you to sign? Like, what needs to happen here? That's the point of that meeting. And then I've got uh, one class and then I'm gonna come home and hopefully play Wildstar. Wildstar went free to play um, last night, I think. Uh, so two days ago for you guys. And I tried to log on this morning and there are two fucking worlds, one PVE and one PVP world. And the wait for both of those was like two hours. I get that it's launch day, basically relaunch day for free to play mode in Wildstar, but you can't have more than two worlds? That's insane. That means everybody playing the fucking game is either this one or that one. There's only two worlds. So I'm mildly miffed at that and I'm hoping it'll clear up or they'll, oh, I don't know, make more worlds when I get home, one of the two. So there's that going on. I wanna thank all of you for submitting all of those excellent questions. I'm going through them and figuring out answers to most of them. Um, uh, like the uh, original video says, that Q&A video is not going to come out for a couple of more months, so I assume I will get more questions in between now and when I actually make the video. But once um, once we reach uh, Christmas, I know I'm not going to be able to answer all of these questions in a single video, so there's probably going to be a few of them, uh, would be my guess. But um, yeah, those will those will be fun coming in. I am I'm eagerly awaiting the time when I actually film and edit those because. I want, it, I want it to be good. I want it to be a good Q&A video with a lot of fast edits and stuff like that. I will answer some of them not seriously and some of them pretty damn seriously. So we shall, we shall have a lot of fun with those in the coming months and weeks and stuff like that. Uh, King's Quest is done. We have a new LP coming up, um, I think today, um, for you guys. I'm not going to tell you what it is. You can just go and watch it. But I will say it is very similar to King's Quest. The only difference is we don't have to wait for an episode to finish this game. We're just going to go through it and then it will be done. And if we all like it, there's a sequel uh, that we can go play as well. But I would have to buy that. So we'll, we'll wait and see on that one. Um, yes is probably about halfway done uh, by my math. So there's still a bit more of that left. Evil Land, I have no idea if we're close to the end of that or not. And I'm pretty sure we're probably like a fourth of the way through Dead Space. If I had to gauge it, probably a fourth. Um, we still got quite a lot of that. And you guys all know that October begins this week. 
So that means that we have a horror game coming out on Friday and a, uh, I'm calling them Martin Core Spooky Movie Moment, um, even though, no, none of the moments I've chosen are spooky. <laughs> um, uh, no, well, maybe one, but I didn't choose it because I was spooked. Um, here's the breakdown. One of the movie moments is just really fucking cool. One, two, three? Hold on, there's, there's that one, there's two, three, yeah. Three of them are from horror movies, but they're moments that made me laugh really fucking hard. Um, so there's that. So we got the cool, the funny, and then the final one is something so terrifying you just won't believe it. It's it's a, it's a whole nother level of this is fucked up. So I got that one. That's going to go out on actual Halloween. So that's the final one. Um, but this one is going to be the one that's pretty cool. And it was also a fan suggestion. You know who you are, fan. That I don't remember your name. But you know who you are. You're out there. You're watching this probably right now. So thanks for the suggestion. It was a really good movie. It was a good movie. See, the problem with the spooky movie moments is even though three of them are actual horror movies, um, I, I'm not a big horror movie guy, so I'm not really sure what I'm going to do in following years um, when I do this again, but uh, I don't, I'm not a big horror movie guy. I, my imagination is really active, so I take it way too seriously, and it fucking keeps me up at night, like... I almost didn't see the first Pirates of the Caribbean movie when that came out because I was too scared, so. I'm a coward. I'm a big, dirty coward when it comes to horror shit like that. Um, the games are fine. Uh, in many ways, those are worse, but somehow I would much rather play a horror game than watch a horror movie. Because with a horror game, I have control. Like, I get sh fucking scared, right? But I'm the one, like, I can turn and run, you know? I can determine what my guy does. In a horror movie, you're just along for the ride. It's like being strapped to a chair with your eyes plastered open and you have no ability to change anything. I mean, sure, you could stop the movie, but then the evil wins, right? In the game, you can run and escape, and then hooray, you've beaten the guy, you know? So I'd much rather play a horror game than a horror movie, but I'm still not a real big fan of either. So, but horror games are a lot more fun. And with the horror games, um, I've got... One, two, three, four. Four horror games lined up. Um, one of them is going to be a two-parter, um, and that will be the Halloween stuff. So, like, on Friday, there'll be part one, and then the following Saturday, like, the next day, there'll be part two, because that'll be the actual Halloween thing. And I know what I'm doing for that. And uh, the first one's already done. And the second one is going to be a fan-made game. The third one is probably going to be the proper shit your pants one. Like, the only reason the, the Halloween game is what it is is because it's the, it's the air quotes, like, biggest horror game that's out right now. So that's why that's getting top drawer. But the, if you want the actual one where I'm probably going to flip my shit the hardest, that's going to be the third uh, game I play. I have no idea what I'm doing for the fourth one. Um, maybe I could do, like, a Minecraft adventure map that's spooky or something like that. We'll play around. Um, but the third one, I think, is going to be the is going to be the big one, uh, because that I've heard from people that that was legitimate pants shitting fear on um, generating video games. So that'll probably be it. That'll probably be the one. Uh, yeah. So I think that's about it, really. That's kind of what October looks like. We're going to continue with the playthroughs. Um, I'm I've got a lot of games I want to play, but I'm kind of holding out for the Christmas sale. Uh, just to kind of go and buy them all. Um, but we're pretty much set for playthroughs for the foreseeable future. And hopefully sometime soon we'll get Legend of Heroes since uh, Yes Origins is almost done. In the eventuality that we beat Origins before uh, Legend of Hero comes out, we'll play something else. Uh, probably another JRPG just to kind of keep that slot open. There's no shortage of them. Like there's one coming out in like October which does look pretty cool. Um, so we might just do that and then circle back around for Legend of Heroes when that comes out later. 
Um, so we might do something like that. I'm not really sure. It's all up in the air. But in any case, um, yeah, school's going well. Uh, there isn't a class I'm taking that I don't look forward to, so that's always nice. I, I despise going to school in general, but once I'm there and actually in the class, I have a good time, so that's not really the issue. But um, I'm just really happy with unclogging that drain, because I was fucking gonna ruin my day, but I fucking did it, because I'm awesome. And now I'll just be careful with it in the future and make sure to run water for like a while to make sure it's gone, you know? Got the plunger under the sink, so I can always just give that a little pop it pop pop and uh, hopefully that'll take care of any blockages that I may have. Is that everything? Need to do my laundry today. I think that's about it, really. It's a beautiful sunny day outside. You can look. Sunny day. The yeah, actual sun. Blue sky. Some other clouds over yon. That's, that's what it looks like outside right now. Which is nice. Which is very nice. Yeah. I think that's about it. So thank you very much for watching, everybody. You can see my messy room over there. It's my bed, some drums. And I'll talk to you all later. Have a good one, guys.